The following video is very important. Hi, I'm Miss Gove, and I approve of this message. Hi, my name's Erin Linkford, and I'm the Vice President of the Uniform Closet. So, as you might all believe, the Uniform Closet is... fun. Sort of. Well, it is when you all remember how to hang up your uniforms. And for the new people, this is a video to explain how to hang up your uniforms so you become my new best friend. This is for the old people to remember the things you might not have remembered last year. So kick back and relax while I take you into a magical journey in the uniform closet. The following people should be the only people in the uniform closet. Now that you know who all these people are, these will be the people who will be giving you uniforms on the concert day. Now we're going to learn how to hang up your uniform. So hi, welcome to the women's section. Yay! Yay. So, as you can see, Miss Lauren Parks here is holding up one of your dresses. Number 43, I'm sorry, we're using your dress. So, anyways, let's take it off. When, well, first, actually, when you come into the closet, this is what you will get. Nothing more, nothing less. Now, when you bring it back to me, here's how to do it and to become my best friend. Well, let's take it all the way off. You, now, in the haste of your concert, you're going to put it up and you're going to throw your hanger the ground. We all do it. It's it's normal. But here's the thing that you need to do. Take out the hanger. Make sure your hanger number matches the tag number. So basically, you will see. This is the proper way to hang it up. Here's the hanger, if you can't see it. As you notice, it is curved. It fits the curve of your back. Shocker. So you put it in like you would put it on yourself. And then the thing that everyone forgets is this part. These straps need to go back on. Because if they don't, it slips, and I get really angry. <laughs> so look, this way, it will fall! Yay! So that's basically it to do your dress. Now here's ways that I will not accept it, like I said. I'm not going to even tell you. I will hand this back to you because this makes me so angry. <laughs> the dress is on backwards. I will not accept it. Look, I can't even see the number. Who am I supposed to know? So, yeah, that's basically it for girls. You got it easier. Boys is a lot difficult. So, come on, ladies. It should take longer for you than the guys. Hello! It's concert day today! This is what you need! <laughs> black <Lauren>. pantyhose <laughs> and black shoes. Now they can't be more than an inch heel, so remember that. Now let's say you forget both these objects. Have no fear! The uniform closet has a couple, not a lot, so remember to bring your own. But if you want pantyhose, five dollars each. Now don't shoes! Share these. Yeah, don't, we don't want them back, so don't ever bring them. <laughs> We don't want them. That's gross. But shoes, on the other hand, are a little different. As you can see, these pretty girls, <laughs> we don't know what shoe size they are. Oh, those are nice. I, don't, I can't believe someone left those here. Now, this is all of our shoes. We don't know what size they are. So if you come up to me and go, excuse me, Erin, I need shoes. I'm going to hand you these. Because they're my favorite. <laughs> So, you just remember that. Bring your own shoes. You don't know whose feet have been inside these. There's probably a reason that they're here. We don't know, but they're here. Probably the aliens descended them upon us or something. So, just remember that. Bring your own shoes. You can buy them at Target for like $10 maybe. Maybe less. Maybe they're on clearance. But, just remember that on the day of the concert, because I don't even really want to touch these. So... Much less wear them. So, remember that. Yeah, I'm going to wash my hands after this. This is really gross. So, you stay classy. Hello, and welcome to the boys' version of the video. Yay! So, as you can see, our lovely model here is holding up a tux. So, this is the thing you will receive from me on concert day. See how we're giving it to you. You'll have the button, button of course, 
Now, you need to give it back to me hung up just like this. And lucky for you, I'm here to show you how to do it. So, yay. Cool. So, this, after concert, this is what you're going to have, because everything else you'll be wearing, hopefully. <laughs> so, basically, what you're going to start with is, well, I guess you could start with a tie if you want. It doesn't really matter. So, tie, over the hanger, easiest part. Next part are the pants. And for some reason, this seems to get you all. I have some bad memories. So, basically, you take them from the bottom, and you hang them. Like so. And you're going to follow the crease marks on the side. Don't follow this. Follow the crease marks on the side. They're really like, if you follow the folds, it's easy. You're going to pop the hanger like our model has done for us. And you just slip it in. Fold it. I don't care which side it's on. And you clip it. And now, they don't fall. Awesome! Next part is you're going to do the tux part. Which just goes on like so. And button it, and that's voila, all you have to do. So you'll take that to me. I won't yell at you. I might even give you a high five if you really want me to. And that's about it. But one last thing. I will be doing a smell check after the concert. And if you have B.O., I will douse it with the girliest Febreze I own, which is Hawaiian Aloha. Sorry, whoever this is. And, also, you can always ask us at the uniform closet, if you didn't, don't have deodorant, you smell bad because of gym, come to me. I have three cans of spray deodorant. And look, it's even for men. <laughs> Yay! So, use it. Don't make your taxes smell because I'll give you a hard time and I have to live in this closet and then it gets really smelly. So, that's all I have to say about taxes. Let's move on to shoes. So as many of you know, for your tux, you need a white shirt. Now the uniform closet does have some extra white shirts. How many? I'm not quite sure. How, like what sizes? I don't really know. But if you do borrow one of these, you have to have a $1 rental fee to your account. So remember that and just buy your own shirt. But if you don't have one, talk to me, we'll get you one. Now the next thing a lot of guys come up to me and ask is if we have any extra shoes. We do, but... Let's say you have really ridiculously small feet. Well, this is all I have for you. I don't know whose shoes these are, but they've been left behind. This is a size 12. And most of these shoes, I don't even know what size they are. So, don't be coming up to me with a specific size, like, I'm a six and a half. Sorry, I don't have six and a half. I have 12s. Ooh, those are nice. All these are ridiculously big. Some of them, for some reason, have this, like, weird heel. Oh, we got some loafers. Oh, the socks already. So, just keep that in mind. Bring your own shoes. Save us time. And you can use them when you're getting married or something. So, that's all. Thank you for watching. Well, as you can see now, we're on to my lovely choir box. It's beautiful, I know. So let's start off for what I have for the boys. Really smelling for breeze. This is for when you don't use deodorant, and then your tuxes smell bad, and then I have to come in the closet, and the whole room smells awful. If you don't use deodorant, your tux will smell like flowers. Remember that. But let's say I forgot deodorant today, or you just came from athletics, or something like that. Have no fear. Spray can deodorant. Can I get a hallelujah? <laughs> Men's Fresh and Men's Sport. Now, I'm probably, I don't know what I'm doing with these yet, but they will be accessible for you, so use it. Please. And for the girls, I have normal Febreze strength. This is for the girls that wear perfume and wear lotion, and then it just gets on the dress and makes it stale. I don't like that. So, your dress will be Febreze. It's not as bad. Let's say you forget deodorant. I got you covered.
On concert day, you will see that there are three signs. Don't mind the middle one. The first one will say A2 Kenny, and the other one will say Kinder to Z. Follow whichever one your last name falls under. You will see that the, you know, this is a uniform closet, and this is where you'll go on concert day. This is where you will get your uniform, and my only thing is that you must stay within these lines. There's two lanes that you must fall under according to your last name. Now you'll see there's an X right there in the middle of the floor. Don't go there. That is the X of shame and I will not help you if you're standing there. Capiche? All right, so we're now in the last part. End of the concert. What are you gonna do? You're gonna hang up your dress or your tux up correctly. But then here's the tricky part. You're gonna bring your tux slash dress back to where you got it, back to me, and you're gonna wait in line, not mob me, and me back your dress. But let's say your grandma's here and you wanna talk to her before you leave. Well, you're gonna have to wait in line and give me the dress beforehand. You can't give it to your friend and be like, oh, turn this in for me, cause it doesn't fly with me, can't do it. And you can't cut lines, I don't do seniority, even though I'm a senior, I don't do it. So, wait in line, yay, and that's about it. So, thank you for watching, um, hope the first concert day goes well, and don't do drugs. Hi! Hi! Hey. Oh. <laughs> Like the uniform beast. No. Ow! God almighty. Ooh, I'll cut that out. <laughs> or and then also it's spray can do it and this oh, and it fell off. That's okay. I'll get it fixed. <laughs> but right. Oh, am I supposed to go? Yes. Yeah, we can cut it out. It's okay. Okay. Hi. Ooh, <laughs> you're not my boyfriend anymore. I got it. No. <laughs>